Hi friends, thank you all so much for coming back for part two of the master bedroom makeover. And if you are new, I will link part one down below. Thanks so much for joining us today. Now, this is where I left you before and we didn't have a headboard. So now I'm gonna show you exactly what I used and how I did it for the headboard and then bring this bedroom together with coziness and decor. So let's jump right in and get started. Now you see here, I have this long chalkboard. This was given to me by a friend and she had said that they had used it for a headboard. And I thought, well, we can too. The problem being that our bedroom only has the one small window and we didn't want to block the view or the breeze. So I had to make some changes to this headboard. So I pried it loose. Each one of these pieces of wood, they were just wood painted as chalkboard paint. So I just gave them a light tap and got them all separated off the main frame. And then we went in and found some old wood and used it to make more railings and filled in those three empty spaces. And they were all the same size and same thickness and that worked out well. We also screwed on pieces of wood to attach legs so we could attach it to our bed frame. And here I'm just filling in those holes and sanding it down and making sure that it's all ready to receive some paint. Keeping the budget low, I just picked up a couple of full-size sheets from Walmart in the flat. Then I just folded them over. No sewing here, friends. I love that part. And then I just used these little clips to clip onto the fabric and they slide across the rod so nicely. You can open and close the curtains with ease and it creates a nice bright backdrop for the room.
For the pet beds, I found these wonderful pack and play mattress pad covers. These turned out wonderful. They were the perfect size and you know babies and pets kind of present the same kind of cleaning challenges and you know with suede dog hair just sticks to it doesn't come off these were perfect they come off they're washable they're water resistant so if they have muddy feet it's easy to clean 10 out of 10 you gotta get these for your beds they just worked out perfect soft cozy flannel buffalo check sheets that I found at Marshall's these are a wonderful here is the headboard installed to the bed frame and this is a shot where you can see it without the pillows in front of it now we're just gonna set the mood